What is apparent motion? The technical definition is an optical illusion in which stationary objects are viewed in quick succession or relative to moving objects. In these circumstances, stationary objects are perceived to be moving by the human eye. The apparent motion of the sun, moon, and stars is caused by a combination of the Earth's rotation on its axis and the revolution of the planet around the sun. Every day, Earth makes one clockwise rotation, giving us our day and night cycle. What we see as day is the period during which our part of the planet is receiving sunlight. Now let's take a quick look at our moon and its stages. There is the full moon, waxing gibbous, first quarter, waxing crescent, new moon, waning crescent, third quarter, and waning gibbous. All caused by the moon's apparent motion. Let's look at the stars. If we were to watch a single star's motion, we would see it making a circle. This is an example of apparent motion. The stars visible in the southern hemisphere will appear to be going clockwise, while in the northern hemisphere they will appear to be making a counterclockwise motion. All of these stars are following orbits around the center of our galaxy, just like our sun. Due to apparent motion, however, they instead appear to circle around Polaris, or the North Star. Since our sun also revolves around the center of the galaxy, we follow a similar pattern of revolution as the stars we see in the night sky. Now, where does this movement, or in Polaris's case, lack of movement, come from? It comes from Earth's spin. Earth spins under the sky once a day, and our spin causes the sun in the daytime and the stars at night to rise in the east and set in the west. But the North Star is a special case. Because it lies almost exactly above the Earth's northern axis, it's like the hub of a wheel. It doesn't rise or set. Instead, it appears to stay put in the northern sky, while every other star revolves around it. In conclusion, apparent motion is how we see objects such as the sun, moon, and stars move from our Earth's perspective.